Now, your Super Doppler 10 forecast from meteorologist Jeremy Wheeler. Thanksgiving forecast. We've got a chance for showers today, not a washout. Scattered showers this morning through noon and then isolated in the afternoon. The forecast hasn't changed too much in the last couple days for today, but uh, it's been tweaked just a little bit. So let's take a look. Right now, we've got high pressure. There's one actually moving away from us. We've got a warm front to the north and a cold front to the west. Another big area of high pressure back west of here that will eventually build in for the weekend, but that's going to take some time. Uh, so right now, scattered showers running right through our region, moving up into the northeast and all the way back down to uh, close to Atlanta. So we've got some showers around this morning. Here's that line. The model's doing a pretty good job of picking up on that, maybe connecting the dots a little too much. But uh, that's what this model does because it's long range. But I want to take it into through time. So this afternoon, our showers here become more isolated. The heaviest rain moves offshore. Still some rain around Boston. And then, well, tomorrow morning, we got some rain to our south around Wilmington, maybe even a Hatteras in the Outer Banks. I think a, a couple, maybe of isolated showers, might come back up into Hampton Roads as that front gets hung up uh, just to our south. But then it moves to our south and we dry things out for Saturday. Right now, it's warm. Temperatures, they're in the 60s. We got 50s to the north, 30s and 40s back to the west. This is uh, a little unusual for this time of year to start at 64 and then end up in the 70s uh, because our average high is about in the upper 50s. So right now, we got temps in the low to mid 60s across the region. It is warm outside. Now, here is the radar. So uh, Super Doppler 10 showing some showers. And at the moment, northeast North Carolina, not too bad. A couple light showers, Kerala to southern shores. We got this one, though, that's a little on the heavy side that's uh, between Reynoldson and uh, western Suffolk, so the Lummis area. You've got some uh, heavy rain, Holland area of Suffolk. That's moving towards downtown. Be there in about 15 minutes. And then up towards Isle of Wight, you've got some heavy rain as well. Smithfield and Carrollton, some heavy showers. But it's pretty quiet Virginia Beach and Norfolk right now. Quiet in Hampton. The rain's picking up into Newport News right around the uh, Denby area. That's going right up into Seaford in York County. And then you've got some showers of Mob Jack Bay and parts of Gloucester County up in the Middlesex County in the northern neck. Here's the eastern shore. You've got showers, Cape Charles, Nassawattox, Melfa, and Chincoteague. And that's all moving east. So this first round might push out, but here comes the second round later this morning, and that runs through midday. But then going into the afternoon, a lot of it goes away. Now it's not completely gone. There'll be some isolated showers later towards the evening time, and that's because the, the cold front hasn't moved through yet. It will move through around this evening. You can see overnight the winds change. And then tomorrow morning, we'll get some isolated showers in here, maybe through noon, but then in the afternoon, I think that's going to move to the south because the winds will pick up out of the north. So it uh, should move into North Carolina or even south of us later in the day. Today, the winds are strong out of the south, about 5 to 15 miles an hour. That runs the temperatures up into the 70s this afternoon. 73 Kilova Hills, 72 Virginia Beach, 74 in Chesapeake, 72 Norfolk and Portsmouth. And uh, we'll be actually near 70 even in Hampton and Gloucester, near 70 in Melfa, 72 in Newport News. Scattered showers, more isolated later today. Isolated showers tomorrow, 62, and then a dry weekend ahead with highs closer to 60. That's the forecast. Now over to you. Coming up, a story you'll want to hear before you start cooking this Thanksgiving, which crock pots are being recalled. Now, your Super Doppler 10 forecast from meteorologist Jeremy Wheeler. All right, happy Thanksgiving. Forecast today, we got some scattered showers. Take the umbrella and the rain jackets if you're heading out this morning through noon. Isolated showers this afternoon, the high temperature in the low 70s. And then tomorrow, we got highs in the low 60s. We'll see a mix of sun and clouds, isolated showers. But we got dry weather ahead for the weekend. Saturday and Sunday, highs near 60.